okay good day and good afternoon uh same look as probably a video that you've seen um but i just wanted to uh do another shoe review for you and i seem to love every shoe that i do a review of um and i guess that that's why they're in my shoe collection um but it might seem like i'm biased but i'll i'll try and keep to the points of quality comfort um uh, durability all those things um and try and cover everything but i genuinely do love all my shoes and i've been doing like if i don't love it i'll sell it <laughs> um or get rid of it or give it to somebody um so i guess the ones that you're seeing are the ones that are true and, and tried but there may be one that I don't quite love as much, but this definitely ain't one of the ones I don't love so much. This is one that um one of my favorite. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Calm down, Gladys, calm down. But yeah, this is the Jean Vitorossi. I think it's called the Vernice. V-E-R-N-I-C-E. -E. So not Venice, but Vernice, and it's in oil black, I suppose um i would yeah so i see hints of purple but it's primarily a green oil spill holographic yeah situation um okay first just look at these um and it goes all the way around and i think the heel height must be like a 105 um it doesn't quite seem like it's a 100 it seems just a little bit higher but if you know anything about Gian Vitorossi and their shoes is that they're pretty comfortable which is quite surprising um considering how high they can be um but also yeah just because it's a designer high heel a high heel doesn't tend to be comfortable but these are so comfortable and they're so beautiful <laughs> um so there you go <laughs> that's kind of the whole review um i absolutely love gosh can you see that oh man okay i hope my camera colored i like i I do all my views on my phone um so i sometimes the quality doesn't come through sometimes the lighting doesn't work out so i hope you can see how amazing these are um they're a simple like pump silhouette a little bit and um uh, the sides are cut low so you you actually with my wide feet you don't even see this it just looks like shoe and then foot <laughs> um yeah hopefully you see in the try on but yeah these are absolutely gorgeous um well designed perfection okay let's go systematically again um i got these from the real real second hand and they hadn't been worn obviously i've worn them now um so i got them brand new they were or oh, i'd like to say they were about 350 um on sale if i'm not mistaken um i can double check that and put that in so that was price and um well, second-hand price, isn't it? Um, I'm not sure what the retail price is. If I can find it, I'll put it up. Um, and size, I got in a size 40 because that I saw these and I was like, it doesn't matter. I tend to, like, if something is a size 40 and I know it's going to be big on me, I would tend to get an ankle strap. Uh, whenever I haven't gotten an ankle strap in a size 40, it's always been big. So with the ankle strap, it sort of holds your foot in at least in, to stop you from wiggling around too much um so it was it's kind of okay i don't like it doesn't bother me too much it would be nice if my my heel could actually touch the back of this but i'm still comfortable enough in these shoes and i still love them and i would not trade them for anything in the world excuse me i just burped then <laughs> uh that's the right moment for a burp anyway so that's uh what was i talking about price comfort look let's just move on comfort um i am gonna give them oh, let me give them an eight and a half out of ten um because i also haven't worn these for ages but maybe i'm just thinking because my foot is a bit small for it maybe my feet will slide forward and sort of squish my toes a little bit that uh, hasn't happened yet but it might um and we'll just see if that happens so i'll just give it a an eight out of ten to start with from from what I've worn from it, it's been amazing and no problem whatsoever. Um, so yeah, that's comfort, a precautionary eight out of ten. Eight or eight and a half. Let me just stick with full full numbers. Eight out of ten, um, and then we'll see how we go. I can give feedback later. Now, quality, super fantastic. If you can see the way the shoe is made, um, the detail in, in here on the side, sort of the scalloped, not quite scalloped, but just like curvy 
edge in the way this comes up and how thin so it's beautiful the only worry that i have for this shoe is over here um it's probably going to get creasing and maybe after a few hundred wears it might start actually coming off so that's the only thing for future that i'd worry about having this ankle strip and especially because it is actually holding my foot in because it's a size too big maybe overuse will cause some problems there but still absolutely fantastic and i think it's a patent leather that's been used and it's made in italy or milan i think it says gian vito rossi milano yeah made in italy um <laughs> as it says at the back so quality is also really good you can tell in in the stitching um there's even a like a little stitching all around is that called pipe stitching all around the shoe um and it's just absolutely stunning uh no problems whatsoever um just i guess a future worry for over here with the creasing and potentially um hurting off the off the leather um so quality that's that one <laughs> i i'm losing track because i just want to talk about how much i love this shoe so i have to be systematic in my review um what else is there <laughs> if i've covered everything look it's about the six minute mark so hopefully i've covered everything uh like i always say if i've forgotten something just let me know in the comment section and i can answer but absolutely love um sizing go to your true to size so i should have gone with a 39 or even 39 and a half but i can still work with this one because of the ankle strap um and quality is fantastic um and yeah highly recommend as well i think all my shoes i've just been saying highly recommend let me review a shoe that's not quite so great um in the next one yeah <laughs> all right thanks for your time and i hope you enjoy oh i didn't even show i didn't even show the other one this whole time i've just been holding one um yeah so thank you for watching and i hope you enjoyed these lovely ladies see you in the next one bye